Television for me is escapism. It's to get away. It's ridiculously large, and these big giant events happen. Oh. Just like real life. <laughs> I'll basically watch anything. I grew up with Bonanza and The Ed Sullivan Show. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Elvis Presley. There was a TV show called Sky King. I'm looking for somebody. Somebody that drinks Buffalo Bill's snake bite elixir. What? This guy would fly in to save the day. Live action. Trying to figure out how they would do that today because they couldn't. Television. It's a way to let down and blow things up without actually blowing things up. I always thought people that worked on television won a lotto. And I'm very humble and grateful. The inmates are loose in the main Sir, corridor. We're struggling to maintain control. 911 is a soap opera, a love ballad to the city of Los Angeles that has things blowing up and falling down. There had been a, a location manager, a wonderful girl named Heather Haas, who did the first four seasons. And God bless her for hanging in there that long because it's just a bear of a show. This season of 911 started out completely crazy. And just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, it did. <laughs> the thing I enjoy most about 911. Oh God. The thing I enjoy most is actually working with my team. I know the other teams are good. I know they are. And I'll be the first one to admit it, but ours was the best. Hollywood Boulevard is shut down quite often for premieres and, and of course the Academy Awards. Shutting that down was quite something. We'd done it once before on the TV show Lethal Weapon. So we knew what to do and we were able to get it done in the time frame. I really thought this year was going to be different. We came in there at 12.01 the night before and started putting all the dust and newspapers and everything because it was a post-apocalyptic scene and people have panicked and the gates have opened at the zoo and the animals have of course wandered down to Hollywood Boulevard because where else would the animals go from the zoo? There is so much content out there. Just once I would like to interview for a show and have them say, oh and Tim, by the way, don't worry about the budget, we got plenty of money. Nobody's ever said that to me in 35 years. I, I don't understand. I'd like to see them get held up just once, just once, just to scare the heck out of them. I've always, always wanted to do a Western. They're out there. I can feel them. We won't see them till they're right on top of us. All the better. When I was getting into the business, there was, there was no recognition for location managers. Without us, nobody moved on the street. Without us, they never got their shot. The COLA Awards were the first awards that, that gave us any type of recognition whatsoever, and I'm so grateful to them for that. 